Hi everybody, it's Q here. Welcome to my channel. If you found me, awesome. Thanks for coming in. Um, I got a pre-shuffle here. I didn't go beyond just the Queen of Wands here, but um, I feel like I'm about to do a Leo reading. So, uh, Leos, what's up? Leo Collective, <clears throat> let's dive into y'all. Uh, let's see what this pre-shuffle is. Uh, again, take what resonates, toss the rest. You can reverse roles if you need to. Could be you, could be your person, could be your pet. Mm, I don't know, pick a thing, I don't know. Ow. <laughs> Queen of Wands, crossed by the Stability King. Who's crossed by the King that has it their way. Concocting something, huh? That wants to give out love. Again, this king has a whole harem of, of women he can choose from, but this boy in love, this boy in love, and this queen's learning something. Normally, she's the fake queen, the queen of pretense, beauty, passion, but here she sits alone, learning something. She learned a new skill. You like music? I don't know. This, this, this king of wands here, Book ending the Queen of Wands is like concocting something. He's just being an alchemist. Maybe you want to turn lead into gold. Maybe we'll see the uh, magician come up here, but I don't know. I see the Seven Swords. What you stealing from yourself? What you stealing from somebody? Short sighted victory. Perched, waiting to pounce. Weird. Perched, waiting to pounce. Hanging from your new perspective. Crossing all that is the Nine of Coins, or Pentacles. Hmm. All right, Leo. You definitely got fire showing up here, and you want some stability. You got a new view on things, but I don't know. What's this? Uh, I don't get negative energy off of this like I normally do. I just get, like, waiting to pounce. It's just like waiting. It's like the kitty, the lion, waiting for the right moment. Interesting. Um, all right, I can dig it. Uh, how was it? Uh, like this. No, I'm confusing myself. <laughs> Don't need to make it more complicated than it is. You're the Empress. Uh, and it Let's see. All right, well, these cards are heavy. They've just been heavy for a while. No. <laughs> Uh, I love Terry. We can make this shit up. <laughs> Ten of Wands into the King of uh, Coins. King of Coins into Justice, Balance, Libra. Uh, Libra, Balance into Look What You Did. Page of Swords. Uh, balance into uh, Holding Truth Close to Your Heart, Resting on It. Uh, putting it to rest, putting it to rest into Karma Waters. Karma Waters about the illusions that we hold in our head. Get to the stable water so we can actually have a conversation and put down this short-sighted barrier that we do to block ourselves from having victory. Dam's about to break. Yep. Love me, does love me not. Um, so weird. Energy coming off this deck right now. It's very weird. Can't place it. Ace of Cups and two. That's Tim Wan showing back up again. So I guess we got this here. Um, why the hell we're here? Ten Wands. All right. Cut. Okay. I happened to look. Three of Swords. Um. Okay. Just because I looked, I won't make it the bottom. But that would have been the bottom card. The overall energy of this reading would have been the Three of Swords. But now it is... Ten Wands. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Uh, I love Tarot. <laughs> Alright, Ten Wands is going to be the overall energy of this uh, reading here. Again, this is going to be a general reading for the... Yo, um... Bottom of the deck now is three wands, that portal forward, the uh, seeing the way through the gate. Let's just think of this as like a gateway. 
Also, do you love me? Do you love me not? Do you love me? Love me not? I don't know. You got time to be at sunset in a garden. Mm hmm. All right. I like it. What are we at? Five sixteen. All right. All right. Got some cards wanting to pop out there. You know, while I'll read them, but we're gonna do a scripture order reading. We're gonna do uh, the connection. Following that will be how the person feels in their 3D, their emotion, their person, what they actually show. And then we'll see uh, how they feel in the soul. Uh, uh, race cups, eight coins, nine of coins, three swords, ten of cups, an inverted knight of wands, uh, the empress and the minor arcana. The Ace of Wands, the Five of Wands, the High Priestess, and to the Hierophant. Wow. <laughs> ah, interesting. Why did the knight get up, turned upside down? Scared of what will be lectured about this heartache? Eh, there's ten cups there. Don't be scared. All fear is an illusion. Go towards your Empress. Hmm. I like it. I uh, didn't mean for a whole book to pop out, but if book pops out, I don't read it. I'm curious. Emperor on the bottom with the knight turned right side up with the wand, so the emperor's coming in passionately. Passionately to share what? The empress. Oh, naughty boy. Oh, Alright. Yos, yos. Got the moon here. We've got a full moon reading tonight. I'm just waiting for the timing. Uh... I think it's uh, 28 or something like that. I was going to pull it then um, when the moon rises tonight. And see what this energy is affecting with this uh, moon in Sagittarius. All right. So, again, we're going to do the connection. Uh, the surface level, like, the meat sack facade. <laughs> the actualness, the soul. Uh, what the universe wants to say about it and potential outcome. We'll go from there. If it falls off that uh, structured, balanced uh, way forward, I won't complain because, well, I got temperance. <laughs> uh, temperance, the Empress, and the Seven of Cups here. So the illusions we told ourselves about the Empress are faded away under the light of angel energy. Temperance. Mm, I like it. I'm give it one more shovel here. The root of 805, we haven't started the reading yet. <laughs> Win bag. Uh, Tempers wants to pop out. And we're going to rest on it. So, I like it. <laughs> uh, connection, the Burger King. Uh, that's, yeah, definitely. Uh, the King of Wands, having it their way, definitely. And Temperance. Uh, so we got Sagittarius energy here. Also, just uh, Archangel Michael. I feel like that's more angel energy than Sagittarius energy. This is like temperance in the raw coming down to illuminate the King of Wands. I like it. Holding the truth close to your heart, to the best. <laughs> Crossing it as a Knight of Cups. I like it. So yeah, this is our reading here. Dam's gonna break. How they feel uh, in the emotion? Three swords. All right. Feel like you killed it, huh? Well, maybe you did. Maybe you didn't. You don't really know. All those are assumptions in your head. Ask the person that knows. Because, well, uh, like a naive passion about this in the soul. Hmm. Universe, what you want to say about this? The sun. All right, Leo. Uh, the universe is on your side. <laughs> go for it, go for it, go for it, go for it. Um, that's weird. Is that like an old 90s commercial? What is that even a commercial for? Uh, the sun, illumination. Again, what I was picking off of the Sagittarius uh, temperance angel energy here is that it was illuminating the truth to the King of Wands. About what? The heartache. 
the pain, the like, this group of four crones overlooking the heart. Oh, this card is so bleh, tar. It tastes like tar. Um, I need clarifiers on this for sure. This page of wands. All right, just your lap to come, the emperor. So you boss up? Or are you stressed out? Either way, I see both. So I don't know now. Weird. That's weird. All right. Um, also, we got Aries. So um, all fire has shown up <laughs> in a Leo reading. Here we got Sagittarius. Leo with the sun, and Aries with the emperor here. I'm about it. All right. Uh, I'm going to put this one down. This was Chatty Cathy. When I picked it up, it was all like, I want to say stuff. <laughs> so let's say stuff. Um, all right, all right. Let's clarify this uh, this King of Wands here for me, please. All right. See, see what I mean? It was just all like, yo, I'm ready. Uh, that belongs here in the soul. Okay. I ain't going to disagree. See, it's just like... Chatty is all good out. All right. Anything else you want to say about the King of Wands at the moment? Emperor. Wow, bro. Look at this. Oh my god. Okay, calm down. Calm down. We might look at that book. I don't know. Uh, first up, we have the King of Wands, uh, Swords here coming with the truth instead of having to face the truth. I like that. I feel like uh, the queen is like facing the truth and the king is coming with the truth. Uh, also the emperor. So this king of wands is the emperor if they come with the truth. I like that. Uh, what's this flying card here? Uh, yeah, that belongs where it is actually. The universe threw that card where it belongs. Like I said, this, this deck wants to talk. Uh, so bridging the uh, Three of Swords and the Emperor was this three-party nonsense, which makes sense. <laughs> All right. Um, okay. Um, clarify the... Um, let's clarify these four faces in this picture. I'm going to be super specific. This is, like, super standing out to me. Like, I can't even see where the swords are in this, other than the swirls of, like, dope look at that it's like literally like if there was bubbles there i'd be worried there's three, three bodies into the water there's four heads look over it it's so weird yeah so i want to know about that what's up with these four heads here what's these four heads about tell me since you're so chatty okay and i'm certain all that just came out in reverse Water into wine. Let's check out these four heads here. Take all this. Take it all in uh, how it is. So, up. You like this? Yeah. <sighs> Old ways. Eight, eight. Walking away. Towards the truth. A Pisces. King of Cups. A Gemini. The Lovers. Doing what it took to survive and stand their ground. So we got eight, eight, seven, seven. The truth slap dab in the center and crossing it is the hierophant spirit. Huh. Now I'm more confused. I said clarify, not confuse. Um, hmm. Let me see what these cards are here on the page. The Knight of Wands and an Inverted Knight of Cups. Interesting. The Chariot. This is literally the Chariot. One wants to go one way, one wants to go the other way. And only the Emperor can pull the Chariot to go one way. Page of Wands. Man. Okay, so, like, you don't know what you don't know. All I need is the moon to sit on top of that. <laughs> well, I'll just, I'm just gonna put that there for now. Yeah, like, 
Anybody else got a read on that? Shit. Um, clarify this, uh, Knight of Cups inverted for me. This belongs over here because it flew over there. This, this right here, clarify this up. <sighs> mm, stay at arms for the reconciliations coming in. They've made a choice, but both of these will still be useful, especially when it comes to my heart. There's the moon. Uh, Pisces energy again. What's coming on underneath the moon tonight? This full moon that's going on. The nine swords in their head. Or in their heart. Because it's tattooed on their chest. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna put the moon on top of that. What's that? All that is this huge freaking secret. Like. Because I asked about those four faces. Whoa. Okay. Um. Man, that is throwing me off. Okay, stop looking at me. <laughs> uh, weird. Sorry, everyone. This is kind of got bizarre. All right. Um, anything else you want to say about the soul connection here? That I feel like they just got to boss up and become emperor and get the chariot, the knight of wands, and the knight of cups inverted going in the right direction. I recommend choosing the way of cups. <laughs> uh, take this inverted now. That's a solid advice. That'll get you to your two cups and break those ten wands. I like that. You see the way forward, riding your lion unicorn. That's my, uh, my judgment on that. <laughs> Go get your wish. Uh, you've had it the whole time. It's just been in your hands. Your wish has been in your hands the whole time. That doesn't mean hermit today. That means my wish has been in my hand the whole time. What was your wish? The Queen of Cups. Best love there is. I just want to be loved. And you manifested it. <laughs> All right, uh, universe, what were you saying over here? The Empress into a tower. And the tower makes you remember how good it was and opens up your world to this new cycle. Man, the moon is just like, boom. Interesting. I almost feel like this is my moon reading. I might redo this. It's not a Leo reading, it's a moon reading. It's a the moon reading. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Uh, all right, so we're having a tower moment over the Empress. I'm remembering how love felt like actual untainted, unjaded love. And that's how this new world operates. Just a bunch of, all, all the dark crows turn into a fast beating hummingbirds. I never noticed that. I like it. Anything else you wanna say about this uh, universe here in your, in your little monologue? No? You threw it onto the final outcome? It goes on the final outcome? All right, move on, move on. <clears throat> Pardon me. Uh, I'm going to read this first. Uh, New Horizons, take it upside down. Yep. Something's holding the Emperor back from seeing the sun. And when I say the sun, it implies everything that's underneath the sun. Uh, Choosing to be a student, becoming stable, and transforming. Inverted, 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 inverted. Okay. It's inverted now. That's a good read on that. 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 No, this is just like, I don't know what the hell. That's a good read here. Yeah, I don't know on this here. I'm gonna come back to this again. I'm gonna relook at that now that everything's out here. Mm, let's put this away. Pull this back out. 
Man, see, I told you it was super chatty. It's all like book, book, book. Uh, okay, so everything's right side up, right? Leo's the only card sitting, facing, as I'm trying to shuffle this. So that'll be my center card, Leo, and a Leo reading. I guess I answered that. This is a Leo reading, 2015. Yeah. All right, give me uh, two more cards here. Sum up this. Maybe that'll help me understand what I don't know here underneath the moon. Shoot. I don't know what's up with that. But I did ask a very direct question. Got judgment on the bottom. That's, that's this one. So we'll go with it. Judgment. Again, I'm going to say it again. It is the divine spirit, God, energy, magnetic field, hoopa wapa, whatever the hell you call it. Duty, job pleasure to punish you not your job <laughs> most people aren't, aren't the level to cast judgment it happens not common uh three and eight billion boom three and eight billion but i don't say that's not very common i don't know why i did that um, i keep shuffling it though Eight of coins back in there. Actually, I feel like that's solid advice. <laughs> well, that was a good pun. What a strange reading. Um, Leo, back to where we started. Queen of Wands. Crossed by the Fool. Jumping into Brave New Beginnings. Hmm. I wish you've seen it. It's been done. So you can know that. You can fly. <laughs> uh, crossing all that, cross, crossing Leo is the Ace of uh, Pentacles. Saying this is a solid foundation for the Queen of Passion. Banish your fears. All fears are an illusion. Have uh, faith via the Leap of Faith card here. And go get your son in happiness. And whatever you got involved with here in the regular world and caused all this heartache with these four creepy ass men whatever the hell that is i don't know what that means but um uh, we'll call it there um uh, i should just do this as an extended but i'm just gonna look at this personally in my honor so i don't hold y'all up so uh take what resonates again toss the rest this is a full moon leo reading here we got so um you never know what you don't know only you know <laughs> or they know uh, and go towards your person with the truth and that'll make you an emperor and they will see you as that and you can have your wish from a uh, like I said before your wish has been in your hand the whole time yeah. it's right there been in your hand the whole time your wish that's my judgment on this reading this has been Q Find yourself in a dark space. I got you.